now underway, the green flags are waving and uh, we are racing in Most. Giacomo Germande leading the way from Peter Fulin Jr. Adam Gold in third. It's a little bit calmer into the opening corner than yesterday of course because we do not have the standing start. So far everybody safely through David Kajaya trying to launch an attack on the Carlo Cepiel for B8. This is Macho, uh, sorry, this is Adam Gold, Macho Homola already passed René Kirche. This is crucial for his championship hopes now. Germandi leading, Fulin Jr. in second. Then we have got Adam Gold in third, his teammate already fourth. Behind his back, René Kirche not really happy about losing one place. He will try to get back past, but it's definitely not going to be easy. It is a tight and twisty track and it is wet. Two minutes left on the clock. Adam Gold diving down the inside on Fulin Jr. René Kircher outbreaking himself and completely missing the first chicane. He actually did get into it in the end, but losing quite a lot of time in the process. Petr Fulin out of position again, and this time he has got Macho Homola alongside him. They are now going side by side. Macho Homola is now through on the home driver. Still tried to from Petr Fulin, yesterday's race winner, and he was already getting alongside, 16 and a half minutes left on the clock, and Yannick Motorsport drivers are now all over, the back end of the Audi Cold, diving down the inside, he's yet to win a race today, Germandi is definitely not giving anything for free, and he was trying to defend really aggressively, but still Adam Gold has managed to squeeze in and squeeze through Adam Gold into the lead of the race. What a move from Adam Gold. And now his teammate Maggio Homo trying to follow suit. Germandi trying to close the door on him, down the finish straight. Who is going to be braver on the braking? Maggio Homo doesn't need to go overly aggressive. Moment. side by side and German is still having the measure of Macho Homola Homola now squeezing it into the left hander and through he goes what a move by the championship leader he had to come up with uh, unconventional ways to get past Germandi and that's exactly what he 